Mixing is an essential part of cosmetic making. There are a huge variety of mixers on the market and it can be overwhelming trying to decide the type of mixer you need for your particular batch size, product type and budget. In this video, we showcase 12 mixers, professional and DIY, all mixing the same solution except Dynamic Misco so that you may compare. To create emulsions, the oil and water phases are combined and a high shear homogenizer is used to reduce particle size. This increases long-term stability. Once the emulsion is formed, the emulsion is transferred to a lower shear mixer. This low shear mixer mixes the emulsion whilst it cools and can also be used for general mixing. We will start with mixers aimed at the Professional Cosmetic Laboratory. First up is the gold standard, the High Shear Rotostata Silverson Homogenizer. This is usually used to form emulsions. In Europe, the Ica Ultra Turax T50 is another popular high shear homogenizer not shown in this video. Another vital and versatile mixer is the overhead stirrer, which is lower in shear than homogenizers. Overhead stirrers are suitable for emulsion cool-down stirring and general mixing. The overhead stirrer shown in the next video clip is the powerful Heidorf RZR2041. Overhead stirrers can be used with a variety of blades to stir different formulation types and ingredients for example, the paddle anchor would be used for surfactants, propeller turbine for general stirring, and the sawtooth dissolver dispersion blade for high turbulence and higher shear for breaking up materials or mixing certain powders. Effective Rotostata high shear homogenizers which are affordable are a rare find. A few years ago we came across Dynamic, a professional food mixing company which sold a variety of affordable stick blenders, some of which came with a rare Rotostata head. Rotostata heads are used in cosmetic laboratories as high shear homogenizers to create emulsions with fine particle sizes resulting in a more stable emulsion. Making skincare together with other cosmetic laboratories entered into discussions with Dynamic, who then altered their existing range to make it easier to operate, stand included in automatic buttons, and included it as part of their MISCO range. www.misco-cosmetics.com aimed at the cosmetic market. The clip shown in this video was shot in 2018 and are of the original Dynab mixers, DMX 160 stroke MX 100, similar to MISCO 250P, their entry level mixer, shown here mixing a small batch size, and the next level up, the more powerful Junior DMX 225 blender MX 110, equal to MISCO 300F, showing mixing a larger batch size. magnetic stirrers which are a staple in any professional cosmetic laboratory. 
The video clips show the M6 from CAT. The second clip shows model US152 from Stuart. Both stir as heat and stir, either separately or at the same time. It should be noted that hot plate magnetic stirrers are low shear and are very weak compared to homogenizers and overhead stirrers, so cannot be used to stir solids, high viscosity solutions, large volumes, nor to form emulsions. In this final section, we take a look at affordable DIY options in action, all stirring the same solution so that you may compare. Home crafters often use certain types of kitchen blenders to replace homogenizers to create their emulsions. First up is a firm favourite, the Bosch High Shear Mixer, which comes with two attachments. One with a normal stick blender head for emulsions over 300 grams and the second with a tiny head which can fit into a 100ml beaker and so is suitable for emulsions less than 300 grams as the head can be completely immersed, thereby minimising air incorporation. The lotion tutorial on our website makingskincare.com contains a link to this Bosch. After the Bosch video clip, we show the Moulinex DD310110, the most powerful of the DIY mixers. This Moulinex does, however, cause quite a bit of turbulence and can overheat. To finish, we show four mini handheld mixers for emulsion batch sizes around 300 grams. We have not included coffee frothers in this selection since their curled round wire spring head aimed at creating froth puts air into the emulsion which can cause instability. To create emulsions over 300 grams, home crafters usually use an ordinary stick blender as this is more powerful than the main mixers. Finding the right mixer at the right price can be a challenge for formulators. Home crafters tend to use kitchen equipment such as a low shear food mixer for general stirring and a stick blender or Bosch with mini head to create emulsions as they are higher in shear. If the budget allows, a dynamic or MISCO mixer might also be used. Cosmetic laboratories use low shear magnetic hot plate stirrers to stir low viscosity liquids whilst heating. However, to create emulsions, formulators switch to a high shear homogenizer such as the Silverson or Ica Ultra Turax. For low shear, cool down stirring and general stirring, an overhead stirrer is vital. We hope you found this video informative. If you have questions, do ask in our Facebook group. If you're keen to learn more, Join over 35,000 students on our free cosmetic making course, learncosmeticformulation.com, with Perry Romanowski from Chemist Corner and Swift Crafty Monkey's Susan Barkley Nichols. Thank you for watching.